So I'm making this video because I feel like, honestly, these past couple videos, I've been getting the most views I've ever had um, because I've been on this website for a long time. My first video was posted eight years ago, I think. Um, yeah, I did a Pokemon card unboxing. So I'm going to share a little bit about myself, who I am, what I like, what are my passions, what are my future endeavors. I think in my last, in my, in my videos, I'm a little bitter sounding and I think people judge me through that obviously you can judge anyone through anything i come off as very like <laughs> judge like a judgmental person um even though i am cri criticizing the thing i'm talking about or just criticizing something in general even though i'm critical um and i can be quite harsh on a certain person like tx2 or jacob collier uh, you know um i regardless have respect for them um, and I think that they they have a place in music. I don't think they should give up their dreams or anything. I doubt like me, a 17 year old kid, is gonna make them feel like that hurt. If that did, I would feel bad. Um, so my name's Logan. Uh, I am a senior in high school. Um, after high school, I might be pursuing college, a four year or community college. I don't know yet. Kind of still in that uh, gray area because uh, uh, there's a local community college that uh, has a full AA based on music technology, so like music production stuff like that. And I'm really into that stuff, making music, uh, singing, drums, everything about it. I love that stuff. Yeah. Anyways, um, and I've been, like I said, doing YouTube for a long time. And one thing that I love is music, uh, talking about music, my music taste, that I found an outlet on YouTube talking about music. And that's why I started like a, almost two years ago. I started doing like reaction based content, which I don't like anymore because it got people to stick around only for the bands they liked uh, for like, I guess me and who I am and what 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 I'm bringing to the table. And now I noticed in my last videos that I've, I've been bringing to this table either being kind of goofy or, um, you know, very, very critical. Um, and by the way, I, I don't know, man. A lot of all the reactions that I have on my channel, like reactions of TX2 or Jacob or anything, they're real. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not putting a facade on. That's my genuine reaction of terrible music, in my opinion. Okay, my opinion. Music is just a huge passion of mine. My dad um, and my mom have really influenced me um, with music. My mom showed me Metallica at a young age, and then I was listening to like Linkin Park forever. And then I also just, you know, I'm a big metal fan. Uh, one of my first favorite bands was The Killers. Obviously not a metal band, but, you know, I really love them. I met Brandon Flowers. That was pretty sick. Um, but my parents have really shaped me into this person that loves music and loves everything about it. Dad was a musician, or is a musician. Um, and he has, like, he used to tour with bands when he was younger. He would be, like, the driver and then the sound guy. So, you know... And he, he actually has four associates um, in uh, audio engineering. I want to present myself as, as a person that's not as a bitter person. Because, um, I don't know, I just want to come off as a kind person. And sometimes in my videos I'm rewatching it, I'm like, wow, I sound like really mean. Even though I, I, I don't cut it out or anything, because like, you know, with the Jacob Collier video, most of that video is me talking about the, the the music and taking it in but i'm just giving my basic like uh, synopsis of it and i just did not like it i'm not gonna fake it and be like oh it's the best thing i've ever heard but i also have other passions i might want to pursue business i am at a crossroads senioritis is kicking me in my ass um i have good grades um i'm doing good in school i have good friends great friends uh i work obviously uh i work at a r italian restaurant i'm getting money I don't make money from this. Um, I was thinking of a way I could make money from doing this. But what I can do is I'll leave my cash app in my bio. Wait, before you click away, you just cash at me some money, right? In the note or whatever, because you can type like a customized note saying roast or toast. Um, or just say roast, and then I'll roast you, toast, and then I'll give you a compliment. Um, any compliment, like it can be the most random thing. I was thinking of doing that. It's stupid. But, you know, saving for college these days, you gotta go stupid or you won't make it. Because, dude, college is expensive, man. That's what I think is the main reason that's kind of barring me from getting in that next step is, uh, you know, I'm doing scholarships and stuff. But if I do community college, it'll still be expensive. If I do a four-year college, it will be very expensive. My older brother, he's doing a four-year college and it is a lot of money. But middle class, you don't get help from the government, but you do, you can apply for the stuff but you might not get it it's a it's a lot of gray area shenanigans and you know america and colleges are obviously you know 
they've been kind of for profit for a million years, so it's already ingrained in the system. Because honestly, a college does not care. Also, content creation has always been on my radar. Because like I said, I've been doing this for almost a decade. I do it for my own enjoyment. Because it kind of makes me like sane. Because I can like just yap and then edit it into a form. Like, dude, that's amazing. I love that. I love having the privilege of doing that and having this gear and stuff. Yeah. So that's a little bit about myself. Um, I just noticed in my in my videos, I'm very, very, very judgmental. I obviously got to hone my craft and really, you know, have my thoughts portrayed uh, in a way that's not as aggressive. Yeah, that's kind of where I'm at uh, in life, uh, you know. YouTube's really just an outlet for me to yap about music. I love talking about music. I make music here and there. Um, I've been, I have like a bunch of demos on my phone. Uh, I have a SoundCloud. Um, yeah, so I've been doing choir for a long time. And then I, I'm self-taught on the drum set. Uh, and then, yeah, I do a bunch of other stuff. I can kind of play the piano. Uh, <laughs> I can frick around on the bass. Uh, guitar, I'm actually hot dog water at. But you know, that's okay. Yeah, that's kind of who I am. Um, yeah, I feel like I want to portray a kind attitude. And everyone's welcome here. No matter your pronouns, no matter your, your uh, race, uh, no matter what, you're welcome into my crib. Uh, so yeah, have a good day. Don't put up with people's uh, nonsense. Um, and then also uh, respect others' opinions. Not just because I, I'm a, like I said, I'm a critical person. Um, I try not to be. Um, I feel like I, I try to, I try to be as open-minded as possible. That's what my mother has taught me. Um, open hands, open hands. And, uh, choose kindness. Um, unless uh, that could be hypocritical in my standpoint, because uh, honestly, some of my videos aren't too kind, and I apologize. But it's not me dogging on someone's career to give up or like, oh, kill yourself. I'm like, no, that's not what I'm saying. My whole my whole shtick is to criticize and kind of poke some fun and then, you know, have a jolly good laugh at it. But, you know, people that are like dark humor fans, you know what I'm talking about? They're like, oh, dude, I love being homophobic, racist, without any repercussions. That's like not me. That's not what I'm saying. Like, if I say something problematic and I get shit for it, I get shit for it and I will own up to it. But, I don't think every, anything I've really said has been that horrible. It's just been my opinion. It's not have, It hasn't jeopardized anybody, I don't think. Unless you're a huge, huge fan of any of the people I've, you know, talked about. Um, but yeah, I'm Logan Suter, um, and I'll see you guys later.